Often, the noise of political campaigns can overshadow what truly matters, the integrity of your vote. According to Statista, nearly half the world's population is participating in elections across more than 60 countries this year. With roughly 2 billion eligible voters, the 2024 election is being described as the largest in history. And one of the most high-profile elections this year, arguably the U.S. presidential race. So we wanted to know what engineering innovations are being implemented globally to safeguard the democratic process. Biometrics, which measure unique biological traits like fingerprints, retina scans, and facial recognition, are revolutionizing voter identification systems worldwide as these technologies help reduce human errors and provide a secure digital backup for voter records, making elections more reliable and inclusive. In many countries, particularly in regions with developing infrastructure, biometric voter IDs are helping to bridge the gap by ensuring that everyone, regardless of literacy or access to resources can participate in elections. This technology provides a secure and accessible way for voters to confirm their identity, even in challenging environments. Biometric technology also allows for the creation of comprehensive voter registries that can follow citizens throughout their lives, ensuring that even those who lose or damage their physical IDs can still exercise their right to vote. During voter registration, various biometrics are captured and recorded to create a robust and unique unique voter profile. The first, your finger. Each person's fingerprint, with its distinct lines, creases, and slopes, is captured by a fingerprint scanner which stores a voter's print in a secure database, creating a reliable method for confirming identity. Next, your eyes. The retina is filled with a pattern of blood vessels unique to each person. During registration, a voter looks into a special camera that uses low-intensity infrared light to capture an image of a voter's retina adding another layer of security to the voting process. Then there's your face. Everyone has distinctive facial features. Facial recognition technology captures those distinct features, ensuring that every voter can be accurately identified. Deduplication is the process of eliminating redundant copies of data by finding all duplications of biometric records. So if you have 10 million people who've registered to vote on various devices at different times, that information is fed into a centralized database. Intusys is one company that invented a deduplication specific algorithm that loads all biometric records onto a single secure server. Their software runs a filtering system like an industrial separation process and in a few minutes, all duplicates come out like magic. Before issuing a voter ID, an authorized agency uses biometric data to check for duplicate registrations. A trained official then reviews and confirms any possible matches. This process is called adjudication. On election day, your information is scanned in real time against your stored biometrics and confirmation is complete. Then it's time to vote. Biometric technology also supports inclusivity by enabling secure remote voting options, allowing people to vote regardless of their location or circumstances. Mobile devices are also enhancing remote voting and improving biometric security. Cell phone cameras are playing a key role in detecting fake faces or fingerprints, making biometric authentication even more reliable. Companies like Folio are already using this technology. With image processing now supported by AI and neural networks, facial recognition is now able to estimate the age of the person in the photo. In the Guinea presidential and parliamentary elections that took place in 2020 and 2021, Innovatrix was able to remove ineligible voters who were minors. The AI-based facial recognition algorithm successfully identified 60,000 such entries out of more than 7 million people. So when the polls have closed, every single person, whether traveling or unable to get to a voting center, can have their votes counted and their dreams of a better tomorrow realized. If you enjoyed this week's episode of The Circuit, don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe for more incredible engineering news. And while we're not performing a retina scan, one thing is for certain, you can look into my eyes and know that these engineers want you to get out and vote.